focus on your breath. Try to breathe in a way that's really satisfying. There are a lot of potentials here in the body and the different properties, the different elements. Some of the things outside are not offering much in terms of entertainment or interest or even pleasure. If you learn how to work with the elements in the body, you find that you have something that's really fascinating. Like with the breath energy, there's an upgoing energy and there's a downgoing energy. When you breathe in, does the energy feel like it's going up or going down? If it goes up too much, you're going to get headaches. If it goes down too much, you're going to get lethargic. But see what you need for balance right now. As for the fire and water elements, this time of year it's good to focus on water. Where in the body are the cooler spots? Locate them and focus on them as you breathe in breathe out. And once you're able to stay there steadily, then think of that coolness spreading from that spot. That's a theory that the elements permeate the body already. It's simply that some parts of them are more pronounced than others. But see if you can connect the coolness that's in the most pronounced part with the coolness in the parts that are less obvious. If you're feeling too lightheaded, think of solidity. In other words, there are ways of bringing the body into balance. When you have the time, focus on finding a sense of well-being inside. This makes it a lot easier for us to treat one another well. We're here, we're here day after day after day, and it's easy to get very tired of the place, get tired of each other. But if you have a sense of fulfillment inside, then the outside situation doesn't weigh so heavily on the mind. And you're much more likely to be able to treat other people with kindness and generosity and all the other things that make life easier for everybody involved. So look at the elements. Look at the potentials you've got in your body right now and see what you can do with them. There's a lot of lessons in terms of well-being, a lot of lessons in terms of understanding the power of thought. As we were saying yesterday, the, the extent to which you shape your present experience is a lot more than you'd suspect. So allow, allow yourself to imagine more than you suspect. Look inside and see what this set of perceptions can do for you. <laughs>